Hello everybody, my name is Chris, and welcome to what we're going to do today. So, let's preface this. We are returning to The Witcher 3 on Wednesday. This coming Wednesday. Which I believe is the 13th. 13th, if I have that right. Now, thank you guys for all holding out, staying strong, all that through uh, the, like, week of no videos. But, what we're going to do before then is it's been suggested, and I agree, that it is a good idea. And it's been suggested in the past before, too, by a number of you guys. So, you know what? It's a good time to do it. So what we're going to do today, we're going to watch the the uh, the Witcher cinematics. The Witcher, the Witcher 3 cinematic trailers that they had released way back when, alongside the release of the game. So it's going to be kind of interesting, mostly because these are like really, um, just from like the thumbnail when I looked them up, uh, they they look like really like high quality CG cutscenes. Um, but also seeing as we finished the game, the main the main game obviously before the DLCs were even out, um, looking back on these might be interesting. So we're gonna start with the first one. Which is uh, killing monsters. We're gonna see because it's gonna be kind of cool looking back. Like, yeah, this game blew up with rewards. Twenty thirteen. That's crazy. It's not when the game came out, but when this By was shown. Of the emperor of Nilfgaard for the murder of the wounded, looting, cannibalism. You are hereby sentenced to death by hanging. Or torment. Ah, no Helen. medal. Take the reward and let's go. Help me! Knew you witches wouldn't scorn imperial gold. Tough hunt. Tougher than yours, that's certain. Evil is evil. Lesser, greater, middling. Makes no difference. Ah, come with me. Bring her down. Do it my way. You like that, you bitch? Get the hammer. Get our teeth in. The degree is arbitrary. The definition's blurred. If I'm to choose between one evil and another, I'd rather not choose at all. Just make it quick, Geralt. Damn. What the? Ha! Alright. That's badass. Hit him! Oh my god. Holy shit. Okay. What 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 are you doing? Killing monsters. Damn, that's oh that's good. That was nuts. Like and this, this is so. This is such a good shot. The Witcher Three Wild Hunt. Okay, that shit was so. For I. Uh, mm, uh, 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 sorry. A lot of things to say. A lot of things going through my mind. Firstly, I loved that last line of just like, "What are you doing? I'm killing monsters," and it's like. Hell yeah. Cause it's like, you know, not just not just the creatures can be monsters. It's like, you know, it's it transcends that being a monster. You know? Oh, it's so cool. And just he Oh my god. It was so fucking cool. Just hit him with fucking R. Get out of here. <laughs> Whoa. 
close your eyes. It's just so badass. It's so good. It's so cool. It's so actually just rad. And yeah, I was like, oh god. Right, because here, No Man's Land, and I'm immediately like, that's Velen. We know it's Velen. It looks like shit, but also, we were there. Don't meddle. Take the reward and let's go. And that's so cool because it's Vesemir. And he's. Obviously, they did a contract, right? Which is why they have. They have the head, right? They have the trophy. They're turning it in. Um, and the person they're turning it into is a piece of shit. And then they take the money and they leave. But. Geralt's, Geralt's monster senses kick in. He's like, I can't, can't walk away. It's fucked up. He kills him. So it's just it's it's so cool. This is actually really rad. This definitely would have gotten me hyped for the game. Hell, it's getting me hyped for the game right now. <laughs> the decree is arbitrary. The Ready. Definitions blurred. If I'm to choose between one evil and another, I'd rather not choose at all. And that line is so fucking good. And I know. In across all the videos, like multiple people have commented that, and I'm just like, I, I obviously now I know like kind of where it comes from, but it does. It had always sounded like something Geralt would say, right? It's just like if I'm to choose between one evil and another, I'd rather not choose at all. <laughs> and it's just like fuck. That's so good. Ah, oh, it's so cool. Okay, hell yeah, killing monsters, fucking badass. Ugh. Oh. Okay, then we have another one. We have another one. Okay, this one is called A Night to Remember. And again, this one's actually rated M. So, you know, for watch out. You know, be careful. This is going to get intense. It's going to get rough. <laughs> so, um, I, I don't know what it could be other than monster related. But yeah, let's just let's get into it. This is a four minute trailer. Amazing. One of the best RP ever one of the best RPGs ever made. Our dark sleep in midst the trees. But all a swaying in the breeze. But one soul lies anxious wide awake Fearing all manner of ghouls, hags and wraiths Nice tune. Been a while since I heard it last. Folk have forgotten it. Got other things on their mind. Things like me. They paid me for you. What? <laughs> In times past, no amount of coin would convince a witcher to take this contract. Times have changed. <sighs> oh, shit. Oh, of course. <laughs> Oh, he looks so different from his in-game model. But it is. This is a high quality. This looks great. Oh, it's badass. A decoction. Is she a wraith? Spectre? Oh, 
sick. Oh god. No. Vampires? Fucked up now. Yeah, he hurt him too. Oh, just turns back. Okay, not gonna lie, that was sick. That was awesome. Oh my god. That was so cool. Like, I don't remember the name of it. I don't remember the name of the 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 the, the potion. But there is one that when you ingest it, the the attacks that vampires do, like your blood actually poisons them. It hurts them to feed on you, and that that's basically what it seemed like he took before he went in there because he knew exactly what he was going after so that was so cool that was so fucking cool that was so sick <laughs> uh and then he had the bomb and everything and it was just like god that that really is what it feels like when you're doing the contracts in the game really you know like uh you go in you prepare and it's definitely definitely feels so much better on death march like i've been i've been thinking about it since since uh switching to that difficulty and how it really is the best way to play the game and i know everybody's like oh you gotta play on death march is the best i'm like and my initial hesitation like way back when was really just like yeah but if it's too hard you know will it still be you know interesting you know to to watch and all that and yeah the lack of ui the the whole more need for preparing preparation for contracts and stuff it's really cool it's really cool i love it so this was this is badass and i like how it started out as just like some normal some normal lady right we go just just like in the game you know we go up, we meet somebody, and they're like, oh, what's going on? And then we find out, oh, they were the monster the whole time. Trying to trying to get him, but Geralt ain't... Geralt, Geralt ain't no fool. That was cool. That was, that was just so sick. <laughs> it was so cool. Ah, okay. Hell yeah. Whoa. And then, yeah, because he still got bit. Like, he still got he still got beat up a little bit. Like, you know, he tired. He's a nap. He's ready to go. Uh, okay, so I don't know if there's any more, but I'm going to check. So I think there might have been. Okay, so there's this one. Uh, it's called, you know, it's not it's not a cinematic trailer or anything. It is the Sword of Destiny trailer. 
And it's going to be the last one we're going to watch for this. Unless there are other ones, let me know in the comments if there are any other trailers that you think we should check out. Because it's really cool seeing these actually after the fact. Because think, thinking back then, seeing them would have been, like, so hype. Like, this game would have been an instant sell after seeing these. And after playing it, I'm just like, yeah, the, the trailers really do really do a good job of selling, you know, the game. It's not like it's set an expectation and the game doesn't really feel that way at all. So it's pretty it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. So we're gonna watch the Sword of Destiny from E3 2014. Way, way back. Once we were many, now we are few. Hunters, killers of the world's filth. Witchers, the ultimate killing machines. Among us, a legend. The one they call Geralt of Rivia, the White Wolf. There he is. We meet again, Witcher. Your Imperial Majesty. She's returned, Geralt. After all these years. Are you sure it's her? Oh, that's... Yes. That's funny, actually. And she's in danger. Witnesses claim the wild hunt follows her. You must find her. And when I do, what then? I shall give her what she deserves. Huh. Damn, look at that. White Wolf. At last. I come for her, but the prophecy. Every decision you make will bring devastation. Each choice will lead to a greater evil. <laughs> so interesting. Oh, there's a little... Ah, uh, yes. Yennefer's bird. Okay. First off, that was actually really sick. But, like, there there was some things that I thought were so fascinating. Like, um, how many, how many little parts of the game are shown in this trailer? And some of those things happen, like, way far in the game. Some happen early. Some don't happen at all. Like, like this? This never Filth. Happens. Witchers. The ultimate killing machines. It's cool. It's Among cool to us, see. A white wolf. We meet again, Witcher. And then Your here... Imperial Majesty. Well, he's, he's on the throne, which, by the way, we never saw him sitting on the throne. He never sat there. And in fact, this whole thing like was under construction pretty much. So it's just it's interesting to see, kind of see this trailer and then like know how that game actually came Damn. out. You know, she's returned, Geralt. After all these years. And then this. Are you sure it's her? And that. And that. Just like oh my god, when you like you know, when you understand. It's like oh. Wow. Just like the little things that they, they knew what they were doing when they made this trailer. Yes. And she's in danger. Witnesses claim the wild hunt follows her. And then here, our boy has an actual crown on his head. Like a full on, like a crown crown in spiky armor. It's a little different than how he actually turned out. It's just interesting. You must find her. 
when I do. And this. What then? I shall give her what she deserves. A lot more ominous, you know? A lot more ominous than he ended up being. <laughs> it's like, oh, he's gonna kill her. Oh my god, he wants to take her to all this stuff, but in the actual game, he's like, you know, just bring her home. I just want my daughter back. Come on, man. <laughs> where, where is it? It's, uh... This. Very interesting. How this, because we went there, that's cool. They showed it off here. And then this, we go, we go through a couple of these. Uh, the voice was a little different back then. I come for her, but the prophecy. And this, this moment. Look at that. He, that is not the same. Really, I mean, it's cool, but it's just, it's just interesting. That's, that's my whole point is it's just like, it's interesting how it was back then and how it ended up ending. And they, they remodeled Yennefer's face. Clearly, that is not the same model we ended up with. And Triz is basically the same it's like a little more refined. Obviously this is an early trailer. The game came out like a year after this though. So um, obviously this is more like they touched it up between then, here and then, but it's just interesting. Look at that. Wow. Station. Each choice will lead to a greater Races. But, yeah, it was just cool. It was cool. I wanted to watch that one, and that was actually kind of cool that we watched that one. That, it actually looked great. You know? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Cool. And then, yeah, to see the final product, it's wild. It's wild. So, seriously, yes. Let me know what you guys think about all these. Obviously, you know, we can get more specific now that we've actually seen them, but it's like, they're pretty sick. I gotta say, like, if if I had to be like, oh, which one was the best one? Like, A Night to Remember was pretty much, like, one of the coolest trailers for any game. Because it really just went through the stages of the entire experience of being Geralt the Witcher. You know, show up, talk, you know, all that. But, yeah, I won't drag this on any longer. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. It's pretty cool. I like them. Thanks for suggesting it. Let me know what you think about all these in the comments, and then uh, look forward to more Witcher. So, see you then. Bye-bye.